Hi, today I'm going to show you about what it cost me approximately to make a 40 caliber bullet. First, what I'll start off with is at the range I will pick up scrap, uh, scrap lead out of the berm, such as this. As you can see, it's just dirty and everything else. I can melt this on a with a turkey fryer. I can melt it on a barbecue grill or I can melt it on a hot plate. And then what I'll do is I'll go ahead and clean that up, make it into ingots. Then I'll buy me, then I have a $20 mold that I bought from Lee, and it'll drop bullets like this. So there you got $20 invested so far, if you already had a barbecue grill or whatever, that you can melt the lead on. So you'll make these bullets. So your cost on them, since it was picked up, more or less free, your propane will cost you. And then, of course, I pick up my brass out at the range. Uh, I'm a notorious brass hound, and I have tons and tons of brass, but I still seem to pick it up all I want. So I'll pick this up, clean it. So you got to, you know, a little bit invested in that. And then for primers, I've been using these tool ammo. These are actually small but I do have our small rifle but I actually do have them for the pistol and these cost approximately 2.6 cents each so you know you're looking at two dollars and sixty cents for a hundred so that puts so right now the only cost you have involved if you don't include this your uh, mold you're looking at 2.6 cents for powder I've been using unique and right now course when they have it in stock which has been a big problem lately this goes for about $17.90 a pound on Powder Valley as of today so your cost per round it uses 4.7 grains your cost per round is about 1.2 cents so you've got 2.8 cents between here or 3.8 cents between your primer and your powder and then more or less you just go ahead and you make it up of course you gotta have a press but there's a load so those cost me approximately 3.8 cents a piece to make with my you know not including my time but just kinda give me a, a what it cost me on these on these forties uh, you know it can be a fun hobby and inexpensive to shoot but of course you've got a, a lot of outlay out front Press might cost you two hundred dollars with dies, and then then your bullet mold will cost you another twenty. So there you're at two hundred twenty dollars before you even start anything. But that's how I kind of do my stuff, and I'll show you some other comparison on other bullets. But you know, three dollars and eighty cents per hundred. It's a lot better than going out and paying, you know. $30 per hundred. You know, I save a lot of money doing it. A lot of people are worried about lead being shot through, through it, but if you get the right velocity, you've got to kind of ladder test those to get the right velocity. You get the right velocity, you can't tell the difference between it or, or, or a uh, jacketed bullet. So, just my two cents on reloading 40 Smith & Wesson with lead. As I say, I've done it for years and I enjoy it and it really saves me a bunch of money. Thanks and have a good day.